Today we are in Arlington, Virginia at the Grove at Dominion Hills, getting ready to check out the Woodward Contemporary Model from Toll Brothers. This home features five bedrooms, six full bathrooms, one half bath, over 5,000 square feet, and a two car garage. You're gonna love the open layout on this one. There's a screened in porch and the home also has an elevator as well. The property is currently listed for $1,949,950. And with that being said, let's start the tour. And if you'd like to set up a showing or have any questions, just reach out to my team and I below and we would love to assist you. All right, so as we walk in, we have our nice formal dining room to our right. This is massive. Look at these ceilings. They got it nicely set up. This is really, has a sense of quality. And then let me show you where we came in from. There's the entrance right here. And then off to the entrance on the other side, we have the office, this is the actual sales office. And then behind there, we have coat closet as well as the bathroom, full bathroom. So this is great as obviously the office, I mean, maybe even um, an in-law suite of some sort, if you wanted to. So here is a cool little hallway. A nice big mirror. This house is so bright and tall. Let's check out the coat closet. And wow, look at this. They got the fireplace going. Nice gas fireplace, feels nice and warm in here. That might just be from the sun and the, the HVAC, but oh no, you can definitely feel the, the warmth of the fireplace. And then we'll pan around here. And if you see, um, you know, it's not the nicest view right now. They're building a lot more of these homes. So it's a nice little development in Arlington. Check out this kitchen. Tons of countertop space. Look at this big farmhouse style sink. And then you see those big silos right there. I think that's a uh, water retention system, I believe. I have to double check on that, but I've seen a lot more builders doing that recently. I think it's required by the county. Look at these appliances. A nice backsplash, kind of a little sizzle feature there, the backsplash. We'll get a view from this side as well. And over here we have pretty long uh, area for the, for the wine or the drinks, more cabinet space. And of course the pantry See, finally, someone staged their pantry. I've seen a lot of these that are just vacant looking pantries. And man, we just gotta get this kitchen one more time. This just has a nice, like I mentioned, kind of like a sizzle feature to it. It's not a bland, boring, stereotypical kitchen. And we'll just pop outside as well. So this is cool. I don't know if you can actually see this, but that's actually um, a screen. So you have kind of like the screened in porch right here. And you might be able to get something uh, for shade to bring that down a bit. Um, and then you can see the land goes a little bit, you know, up until um, that area right there. So it is flat, which is good. We'll head back inside. And I almost forgot you have the elevator right here. So that's 
pretty convenient. We'll be taking the stairs today, but let's go check out the upstairs. Got the dark stairwell. So off to our right, we have laundry. There you go. And we have our first bedroom. Man, they went all out with the staging. And then actually right across the street is Upton Hill Regional Park. So that's kind of a cool area. They have mini golf, there's a swimming pool, batting cages. I think there's like rock climbing. I remember going there as a kid for summer camp. Good times. That's a nice shower. The frameless door. And you also kind of have a view into Boston, you know, if you can see a little bit further out. So, you know, obviously there were some stairs coming up here, but the good side of that is that you have a, have a decent view. All right, let's check out this closet. What are we working with here? Oh man, this room is massive. It's just one bedroom. This room is huge, so this is like the kids' room. This is a really good size. It's tile. So yeah, this room goes all the way back here, plus the closet, the little baseball jerseys. And this is our third bedroom. Not as big, but still a very good size. They got the Toll Brothers branded towels. You know, maybe if I do enough Toll Brothers videos, I can get some Toll Brothers merch. Get this nice modern trim around the windows and doors. And then another closet. And what's nice about this area, it's a very wide space. So here's your elevator. And then, oh, this primary is massive. So a couple years from now, you know, that's gonna look pretty nice. Probably just a year or two from now. Every builder says they can build in six months, but sometimes Arlington County can be tougher with the permits. but I think Toll Brothers kind of knows what they're doing, so. All right, this is the first closet. We got Chanel, Neiman Marcus, with a bathrobe too. And then this is the smaller of the two closets. And the best part, the drum roll, the master bath. So look at this tub. And then we got the shower right next to it with the bench, a couple fixtures, and sink number one. And on the other side, sink number two. Good sized towel closet here. They got every closet staged. And that's the way you should do it. If you're selling a house, you should try to stage every room. Sometimes you might not think it's necessary, but I can tell you from builders and developers I work with, you know, if you really want to sell a house, you stage it to the max. 
All right, so let's check out the basement. They got these cool dark staircases. Then down here they have the light flooring, which I think is a good idea. I think stairwells is really the only time you should do the dark flooring. But this is really cozy and tall ceilings. So that just goes up to the backyard. You know, you do have some stairs there. And then you have this little room. This is kind of like a storage area, but it is big enough to use it for, you know, maybe something else, but definitely a good storage room. And then we got this little space. Great for entertaining. There's so many doors to open in this. That looks like an electrical, um, panel or get the full bath in the basement a nice full bath and you got the bedroom down here so you could have someone stay down here on the main level and of course upstairs get another look at this area and we'll keep on going so we got the two-car garage and then you also have space in the driveway and then here is the mud room with the closet and then we got a another storage room maybe somebody could finish this off there's no window but you can make it like a little den of some sort all right so let me know what you thought about this one in the comment section below and be sure to check out some other property tours and if you want to set up a showing for this one or any others just reach out to my team and i below and we would love to assist you